$18.2 million is giving NYCHA residents the local community access to sustainable and healthy food. This is a key part of environmental and food justice. This is the beginning of something new, but this is more so the beginning of something great. Too often, moments in our public spaces are cut short by the uncomfortable realization there's no restroom here. Relief is on the way. Over the next five years, we will be building 46 new public restrooms and renovating 36 existing. We made a new Google Maps layer that New York just access on your phone to know where to go when they have to go. It is my hope that one day New York City will be a place where everybody has access to a safe and sanitary toilet whenever they got to go. We are investing $32 million to protect important long-term New York City public school programs. We are also able to restore $20 million in the Summer Rising program. Additionally, we are investing $75 million to allow schools and principals to proceed with certainty and continuity. We have the opportunity to give New Yorkers what they need and provide them with the support they deserve. We removed more than 41,000 illegal motorized scooters, mopeds, ATVs. No one is above the law, and if you drive an illegal vehicle, you will face the consequences. These motorbikes are dangerous. They're reckless, and driving them around our city is against the law. I want to thank you for your heroic actions, but I want to thank you for your consistency and dedication and commitment to be someone that is willing to run towards danger, not away from that. On behalf of a grateful city, thank you for always answering the call. God bless America, and may God continue to bless the FDNY. We are African Americans, and on Juneteenth, we celebrate all that we have contributed to this great country. Gun violence is the leading cause of death for children in this country. The Department of Education of New York City will be disseminating safe storage information to all parents and their communities. This is such an important, simple step we can take. Our officers responded with a level of discipline, a le level of focus, and a level of professionalism. Because of this vest, a young police officer is going home. This morning, we get another reminder of everything our officers do and what they do to put themselves on the line to make sure our city is safe.